money. Welcome to Gold, the Charles and Tubes Olympic Gymnast. My name is Barney Sue Number One and this is episode number 72. 72! I'm so excited. Well, if you saw yesterday's episode, my shoulder had some challenges. Because I pulled a muscle back here. I've been working with my doc, my chiropractor, to crunch through it all. And it's kind of painful. Not kind of, it is painful. When she's going after it, and she's getting a thumb on the main belly of the muscle and pressing into it, I mean, I want to scream. I mean, I don't, but I'm like, it's very intense. My, my feet are moving. Um, I don't cry, but I tell you what, it's very, very painful. And she's diving directly into the middle of it and pushing on it. And it's like, on a scale of 1 to 10, it's about a five and a half to a six. Now, I have very high pain tolerance. For those of you who know, I broke three ribs and didn't really know it and kept training on it. So, they're pretty high pain tolerance. So, a six for me is about an eight for a lot of other people. So, she's diving into this pain and I'm just lying there and working through it all. But I tell you what, it's feeling much better. I still have more to go. See how it's not coming in cleanly? The main, the main muscle back here is got the problem of this rotation. But what's happened is we've been working through all the other muscles that have been going out in support because I've been training so much, all the other muscles around the shoulder also were supporting that. So it's going to be a while. We've been icing it and everything else, but on the right track. Well, this morning, I'm not training with Coach. In fact, Coach is in Palm Springs. Coach, if you're watching this, have a great time in Palm Springs. You deserve it. He works so hard. He is so amazing. I'm so so blessed to have Coach in my life working with me. So Coach decided that he needed some time off because he was working so many hard with me and everyone else. So he went to Palm Springs to sit there by the pools and relax. And I decided to go down to LA Fitness before visiting Doc. So I visited her last night and she did some work on there. She's going to visit us this morning. But she was going to Atlanta. Like everyone's going everywhere. So I got I got uh, to LA Fitness and I wore my Cirque outfit. I just love this leotard. It's like it was called my Cirque C I R Q U E, and that's the brand name of. So I wore this down there. And last time I did this, I got a pen slinky, and it's like really flexible. Just, I don't know what it is. This one just seems to have that. And so I put it on there. Well, it took me about five bridges before I kicked over. But once I kicked over, bam, it all opened up. I did three kickovers, bam, 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 all consistently, all clean, exact. Slinky, stand there, arm all the way to the back, kick over, kick over, kick over. So I did three slinkies, great. Then I did a front, lim front limber kick over. So that's from here to a handstand, from a handstand, put your feet down, then kick back over. Three of those, and then do a slinky straight after it. So I call it my FLKOS, uh, front limber kick over slinky. So I did three of those, cleanly. Then I did, um, Back bend, we lean all the way back, then push it all the way back up. No steps, no trouble, effortless, easy, back, beautiful every time. Three of those in a row, no problem. Then I did handstand to front limb bar, that's in that, it's in that bridge, then stand up. Three of those, effortless, no problem. It's like, oh my God. So then I started doing some multi slinkies. I was going for the octo slinky, didn't have the strength. Arm is playing up for endurance. So I only got two, two triple slinkies. Well, after that, I decided to go for the back bends for the back walkover. And that was great. I actually got two out of three hands to the ground with complete control with the foot elevated. So the balance part is coming in. So, that's what, so today is my most flexible day ever. Most flexible day ever. Can you believe that? So excited. So in a moment, I'm going to come back and I'm going to share some more exciting news. Well, this morning when I got up, it was blue skies. And I, I could even see a small cloud in the far distance. This is San Diego, of course, so we don't get clouds very often. Well, we've had some rain the previous couple of days. Why do we need rain? So we can get our snow fields filled with snow. But the snow fields are about two hours away, for those who don't know San Diego. We get to have everything around here. So we've got the beach, which is about 10 miles from where I live up in the mountains. And we have snow about two hours away. So we get to have it all. That's, that's what Californians, we get to have. We get to have it all. So we get to have snow, get to have the beach, get to have all the gymnastics and everything. Well, a couple of hours days we had lots of, lots of rain, lots of snow up on the mountains. Lots of snow. Well, today it's blue skies. I saw one little cloud in the distance. It was just a great, great day. I was so excited. I feel so blessed with everything happening with my life. Well, when I was down at LA Fitness, I recorded some for you. So you can be able to see some of the slinkies, back walkovers and footage like that. I'm just being very careful and doing it only when I'm around, no one else around. So that way there's no complaints from other people about me recording them in the open, etc. 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 So 
I'm just not going to do a lot, but just a small amount of recording to keep you updated with all my incredible progress, and I am progressing so well. I don't think it's going to be long before you see an episode with me doing an Octo Slinky, if this can happen, and, before, and sooner rather than later. So, check out the quick footage here of me doing some of my stretching routines, and I'm going to come back and wrap it all up. One more time. Yes. Others quit when it gets tough. Ooh, ouch, stop. It's enough. So step aside to watch success. Every rep I do, I do progress as I drive it deep into my bones. Over time, this skill I own, piece by piece, block by block, I perform even better, solid like a rock. I love to work, I love to train Success is mine, no need to explain I win it all, and here's a clue While others talk, I just do Gonna drill, drill, drill that skill It's gonna be mine, what a thrill yeah. You think you've got it? Good, do it again Track all the progress, record the detail With focus like this, I can never fail Tenacious in my goal with a burning desire Never gonna stop cause I'm on fire Others watch, they stand in awe While they slipped, I was out the door I train and drill while they rest That is why I'm simply the Success is mine, no need to explain I win it all, and here's a clue While others talk, I just do Gonna drill, drill, drill that skill It's gonna be mine, what a thrill Woo! Looking good Like you got it Almost friend from Hawaii coming over so she's going to give me a like an hour and a half lomi lomi massage which is like a special Hawaiian massage then tomorrow night I get a two hour massage I ain't need it on this body I've got to get all my muscles smooth and all the kinks out of them all and just work through because I'm pushing my body so hard but here's what's happening I'm getting great results coach is excited I'm bordering right now I'm, I'm within probably four weeks I'm going to get my first, I'm going to get my level, level 5 and 6 beam trophies. Yes! Because I'm finally get to do the front handspring off the beam. As soon as I can nail that handstand and hit flat back and get 4 or 5 of them, then I just have to go to the next stage with Coach, which is really exciting. We're making awesome progress, if you've seen on previous episodes. Well, the front, the front limber kick over, when I go handstand, bridge, kick back over, very soon, as soon as the shoulder's healed, I'm going to be ready to do that as part of my level 4 routine that I get level 4 floor and level 4 all around which is really exciting and then very very shortly I'm going to be hitting the beam level 5 beam and getting the complete routine now I can do long hand kips on a more regular basis again shoulders healed my kips are looking good and I have the arm strength bam I'll get that level 5 trophy because all the pieces are there so exciting on the verge of big breakthroughs so that's what we've got time for this is Bobby Sue number 1 from Gold the trials and chips of an Olympic gymnast Thank you so much, and we'll see you on the next episode.